Hey guys, welcome to Space Decoder. Today we will recreate Mercury Redstone Rocket. Space Decoder. So I'm in Simple Rocket 2. And today we are going to recreate the Redstone Rocket project in Simple Rockets 2. So this is my little astronaut. Alan Shepard, the commander of Redstone. Let's just hop into right into the rocket. Now, let's just count down. Yeah. Launch. We have a lift off. Great. So, let me tell you more about this Mercury project. What actually happened is that um, USSR was leading the race in the space race. So you has US had to do something, and that thing is the Mercury program. Mercury program consists of um, a capsule that is being launched suborbital, and it is launched suborbital with one astronaut. So it has capacity of only one astronaut. Let me take some shots here. Yeah, for the thumbnail, you know. So, these are the thumbnail shots. Now, let's just resume the game. So, I was talking that, yeah. This rocket just goes up to 100 kilometers or more and then come down back to the ground with only capsule. So, this is how I reached the suborbital range. I didn't go fully orbital. Then I separated my capsule. And now we are going to land back on the Earth. Yeah. That would be pretty awesome. Now we are heading back to the Earth. Let me just speed up this. Yeah. Wait. Let's get some camera shots. So guys, do you like this space race topic recreation on Simple Rockets 2? If yes, then please comment down below. So this game is pretty fun to play because it offers so much things like rocket science in an easy way. So we could learn how much fuel a rocket could consume or anything like that. Now I'm going to do some space walk. Let me just open my hatch. Yeah, now I'm out and tethered with the tethered with the Oh no, uh yeah, with the capsule. So, let's go back to our booster. I know this wasn't recreated like this. I'm mean, created like this. But still it's fun to have to watch our own booster in the space floating back right to the earth so let's have a look to it okay now let's just get back to our capsule yeah or should we go no 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 we should come back to our capsule so after this, I would be heading back to our Earth, our planet. So, oh, oh, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. The capsule is rotating, revolving me around me so fast. Oh no. It would be quite hard if Alan Shepard really experienced this, yeah. So, I am I have entered my capsule. Let's just speed up the footage, yeah. Okay. Let me speed up this a bit. No, first I have to set this to retrograde, yeah. If it, if it isn't set to retrograde, then it would fall back to Earth in any direction. I have just logged my retrograde direction. Retrograde direction is nothing but um the direction which your rocket is not um, propulsing towards or not moving towards or opposite towards the motion of your rocket yeah so 
let's just speed up the footage really quick now we would enter the atmosphere quickly you can see how is the speed increasing but no problem as we would reach the ground safely so let's just get back oh no quite fast that was quite fast so you know i think that this recovery uh, type is more suitable for um, countries near the seas or ocean but the best recovery type is propulsive landing of course though it isn't safe but still it possesses a lot of um, safety in other means okay so we are going to do splash down 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, splash down! And we are into the ocean! I mean, on the ocean! Yeah. So, this was the recreation of the Mercury program. I would leave you with the background music, so enjoy! Bye bye! Have fun.